Swansea with Chandra and other colleagues working out in Bangladesh. So we have the international connection. What's the best thing about this project that you've done Being today? Being with all of you again and experiencing with my friends. The best part was using trading all the pastels to make different types of colours. Yeah, brilliant. Uh, using a lot of colour. A lot of colour. A lot of colour was used today, that's for sure. Using pastels. Mixing the pastel colours. Mixing the pastel colours. What did you learn from the visit with Tanjil and Sergey? Well, in Bangladesh, children find their life challenging. Why? Because they're poor and... Uh, Bangladesh is really poor and they have a lot of po poverty. Bangladesh suffer from lots of natural disasters. Brilliant. And that they were happy because they had the red dress and they, they wanted to smile but they couldn't because that's what their life is like. That their favourite food is shrimp for some of them have diseases. They do fish farming to survive in the village. Um, the left hand is considered unclean. Even though we don't consider ourselves to be in maybe a society that classes themselves as very poor, actually we face very real challenges here. They're just different to the ones in Bangladesh. However, We've, we were all working to try and alleviate the things that challenge us in our own community, so it's been good to look at how people do that in different places. Yes, we're now going to link it to um, our work with religion and CAFOD and study more about Bangladesh. We've learnt a lot. Thank you. What do you think children are like in Bangladesh? Oh. Are they different from you? Yes. yes. Do, do they draw well? Yes. yes. Some of them can't draw and some can. Okay. Um, they're way more grateful than we are because we wish for everything in their world whilst they just wish for food and clean water. What about their challenges of life? What do you think the they, they big, big, biggest things for them? What are their problems? They haven't got money. But it's not just money, is it right? Food. Huh? They don't have any drinks. Well, well this is... Do they... they hardly have a place to live in. They don't have any showers. <laughs> they don't have an education. Living poverty. They have diseased shrimp. That's true. Um, where they live in Bangladesh, like if there's floods, so they have the re the water raises no no now and then. Excellent. Excellent. And what would you want to what would you want to say to children in Bangladesh? So we're gonna take this for other paintings. What would you say to them? Good luck. Okay. Good luck. Trust in yourself. Mm -hmm. Believe in God. Well done. Keep your faith in God and one day he might give you money and a nice home. Mm -hmm.